This is episode 2307 of your daily guided meditation. I'm Mary Meckley and welcome back to a brand new series. We're launching into a new theme as we start our week. And I'm excited to share this week's theme with you, which is Back to the Basics, Refreshing Your Meditation Ritual. You may be brand new to meditation, and in that case, you will enjoy this week's series as you learn how to create a meditation ritual. If you are already a seasoned meditator, maybe you're a long-time listener of this podcast, you are going to enjoy revisiting why you decided to meditate and how to refresh your meditation ritual. It's good to go back and readjust how you do things because every day that you meditate brings different awareness, different insight, and your life evolves and changes. And you may find that periodically you'll want to enhance your meditation ritual. It can become a little stagnant. And so it's good to refresh how you're approaching this precious time of stillness that you give yourself. I want you to congratulate yourself right now simply for being here. I honor you for doing one of the most important things you could possibly do, and that is to meditate. You might be doing the most important thing you could do for yourself all day today. I also want to mention that over the past few days, you may have noticed that I didn't upload a new episode. That is because I scheduled the uploads to happen all in one day. So I actually released several days worth of episodes by accident on one day instead of staggering them over several days like I normally do so that you have a fresh new meditation every day. Well, I'm back on track and I'm bringing you your first meditation for the week. You will be guided as you do a full body scan. This is a classic meditation technique that I recommend you do every time you meditate. On my Sip and Ohm meditation app, which you are invited to explore for an entire week, free access to the full more than 2,000 meditations, you can be guided in 30-minute experiences and you are guided in a full body relaxation every single time. It's that important. So I'll guide you on how to do this today. And then you might want to do this each time you meditate. As you go through this series, I'm going to be sharing with you inspirational quotes from the book, which is a meditation classic. It, in fact, is considered to be one of the 100 best books written in the past 100 years, and that is the book Autobiography of a Yogi by Paramahansa Yogananda. And I decided to share excerpts from this book with you because Paramahansa Yogananda was one of the first people to come from India to the West, he came to the United States and he shared meditation with Westerners in a way that fitted a Western lifestyle. So he accommodated the culture and the preferences and the lifestyle of Westerners, which he considered to be outwardly active energetically engaged and so he thought westerners would be fantastic meditators so as i share different quotes from paramahansa yogananda you'll notice that the way he shares meditation has to do with showing up as your best self meditating to become 
your best, to share your best with the world. And it's very similar to Stoicism, the way he shares meditation. The ancient Greeks and Romans, I've shared many Stoic meditation series with you. You can go back through my library and look for those if you're interested in that. So you'll be guided to become your best, to tap into your inner truth, to share that with the world. That is going to be the emphasis as you're guided through classic meditation techniques this week. I will also be supporting you on my Sip and Dome Instagram every day with a journal prompt. I encourage you to journal. This takes you so much deeper into a series. Journaling is a powerful tradition and it helps you meditate better. I'll also be sharing the meditation techniques with you there so I can be like your private coach on my Instagram stories. So I think you are all set. I'm excited to share your very first meditation, which is a full body scan. And as you settle yourself down, make sure your body is comfortable so that your mind can relax. Sitting up straight, close your eyes. As they're closed, gently elevate your eyes upwards to the point between your eyebrows. This is your third eye or spiritual eye in yoga and meditation. It's also where your prefrontal lobes are located, the part of your brain that meditation enhances to help you manage your emotions better. Inhale and exhale through your nose. As I guide you through a full body scan, notice any emotions associated with different areas in your body. Consciously relax the different areas of your body. I share with you the quote by Paramahansa Yogananda from Autobiography of a Yogi. Live quietly in the moment and see the beauty of all before you. The future will take care of itself. This is your time. The only thing you need to focus on right now is this time of stillness. Consciously relax your face. Relax your jaw. Soften your throat and relax your neck and your shoulders. Relax your chest. Feel your heart open up as you become receptive to stillness. Relax your arms by your sides. Relax your hands on your lap with your palms upwards to feel more open and receptive or downwards to feel more grounded. Relax your stomach, releasing tension there.
Relax your hips and feel grounded and connected to where you are seated right now. This sacred space that holds you as you meditate. Feel gratitude for where you are and what you're doing right now. Relax your thighs. Soften your knees. Relax your calves. And relax your feet. Beautiful. Scan your body and notice where you may hold additional tension. Work with that tension. See if you can create a little more space there. Easing into peace and stillness. Allow yourself to sit for however long you feel comfortable doing so. Always end your meditation on a high note. Enjoy the beautiful sensations you've created with your full body relaxation. You are so worth slowing down for.